You can stand a little closer. Yeah. Some bright lights. <laughs> Okay, officer, if you could just uh, say and spell your first and last name for us. Senior Police Officer Rhiannon Cunningham. Last name is C-U-N-N-I-N-G-H-A-M. First name is R-H-E-A-N-N-O-N. -N. So tonight at approximately 6.43 p.m., um, a disturbance call was placed to 911 uh, for a disturbance in the 900 block of Bird Creek Drive. When officers arrived on scene, they were began performing CPR on a Hispanic male, approximately 30 years of age. Shortly thereafter, EMS arrived on scene uh, where they transported the male to Brackenridge Hospital and he was later pronounced deceased there at Brackenridge Hospital. Uh, the subjects involved in the disturbance are believed to be known to each other, so there doesn't appear to be any further threat to the public at this time. Is, so homicide investigators are on scene conducting their interviews as is routine. So, of course, we'll know more about the details um, here in the future. Um, we had neighbors um, tell us that the suspect took off. And is that person in custody or still? The person is not in custody, to my knowledge. Um, but I don't know any details about whether he was here or took off or anything about that. So you don't have any description of vehicles or suspects or anything to provide? No, um, we, they do believe that the suspects were known or the suspect was known to the victim. Um, so they're they're moving forward with that as part of their investigation. Can we say any more about what what led this man to be on the ground in this condition? We don't know. All that came in was a disturbance call, so I don't know the details of the disturbance at this time. Okay. The neighbor said gunshot. EMS said he had gunshot wounds. Can you um, confirm that the man was shot or how many times? I don't know the number or the the extent of his injuries. I just know that when officers got on scene, that they were they did have to perform CPR on him. So uh, APD can't confirm if it was gunshot wounds? I don't know the type or the details of his injuries right now. Okay. Yeah. Do the victim live over here in this area, do you know? I'm not sure if he lived over here or what the circumstances of, were of this area. Just know it was in the 900 block of Bird Creek Drive. Uh, you said a Hispanic male was the victim. Yes, sir. Do we have any other description of the potential suspect? No, I don't know anything at this time other than that they appear to be known to each other. And that's why we don't believe there's a threat to the public at this time. Um, but is APD actively searching for the suspect? Yeah, absolutely. We have officers on scene. We have homicide detectives conducting their investigation, talking to witnesses on scene, because I know there are a lot of people out here. So yes, they will be actively looking for that person. Were, were there other people out there that saw it? Eyewitnesses? Or... I'm, I'm not aware of the number of witnesses or if there were any. I mean, yeah, there, this seems like a, a pretty busy neighborhood just by the amount of people that were out there at the end. It, it, is this an area where it could have gone worse? I mean, had, had those other people, you know, were they in danger, I guess, earlier? I can't say. I'm not very familiar with this area. Um, I mean, it is a residential area, um, but I don't know the number of people that were out here at the time that disturbance happened. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you.